Alright, to get started, I added a video of myself to my timeline, and I'd like to blur the background. Let's begin by going over to the effects panel, and type Gaussian Blur into the search box. Then drag it onto your clip on the timeline. Before you do anything else, make sure you position the playhead at the start of your clip. Then select your clip on the timeline, and go up to Effect Controls. Under Gaussian Blur, click the Free Draw tool. Then in the preview, click around your person to outline them. I'm going to do mine quickly, just so you guys get the idea. Be sure to connect your last point to your first point to complete your outline. Next, click the Mask Pass Play button to track the person. Okay, this looks okay, but unfortunately it looks like my tracking messed up at a few points. To fix this, I'm going to position the playhead where the tracking first started messing up. Then you'll need to make some adjustments to your selection, and hit the track forward button again to overwrite the incorrectly tracked frames. Okay, this is looking better, but there's still some tracking problems, so you'll need to keep moving your playhead to the troublesome spot, adjust the selection, and then track again from that point. Alright, this still isn't perfect, and I could keep adjusting the tracking, but you get the idea, so let's move on and blur the background. First, make sure the inverted checkbox is selected, because you want to blur everything but your selection. Then increase the blurriness to your liking, I like keeping mine low around 30. Okay, now when I scrub through this, it's looking pretty good, but I think my selection cutout stands out. The first thing I suggest trying is increasing the mask feather to smooth your selection out. You can also try playing around with the mask expansion to get a better result with your feather. Alright, I'm pretty satisfied with this for a quick job. That's all from me, thanks for watching and see you next time.